We've spent the last nearly two years uh, praying, considering together, uh, where is the Lord taking us as a church? And uh, we've spent a lot of time, you know, us with our pastors, our directors, our, all of our staff, praying together, seeking prophetic input, and really looking at vision for the next five years and what this church uh, is supposed to look like in, in God's destiny for the church five, 10 years from now. And we wanna unpack some of these individual components that we feel that the Lord has laid on our heart for the church. And so today we're gonna dive in with one of those uh, statements as it were, and we've got a number of these that we'll unpack through different videos. And so today we're talking about, we are seen by God as passionate pursuers of him. That is really evocative for me. And I remember this is one of the first statements that we kind of landed on, wasn't it? It was like, there was just something on it for us um, that, that felt like the breath of God was in this. And this is a part of our identity always has been, but it's, it's worded interestingly, and I would love for you guys just to unpack that for us for a minute. What do we really mean by that? What does it look like for us to be seen by God as passionate pursuers of him? Well, I would say um, when you talk about being seen by God, come on, like I remember years ago, just some of my traditional upbringing, I went to church to hide from God, if that makes sense. Um, and so it wasn't till we came to this church that I realized that actually he wants to find me. He wants to see me in the midst of all that, that, that I'm doing here, all that I'm experiencing here. And, and when I got caught of that, when I realized that God wants to see me, he wants to see who I am inside, I was excited. I was excited to come to church and like just get in here and just, get worshiping and being in the word and praying and talking to the people in the congregation because I knew God had his eye on all of us. There's a passage in Jeremiah that says, if we seek him, we'll find him. Mm. And so I think that that's perhaps the greatest call that every single person has and that every church entity then has is that if the highest pursuit is to know God, to have him know us, uh, definitely we want Catch the Fire to be a church that's no one, forget about our community. It's, we're doing this for God. Yeah. We're not doing this for each other. We're not doing this for the band. We're not doing this for, you know, like the press. We're, when we gather together, when we're individuals, we do it because God's watching and we want a big smile on God's face. I love that. I love yeah. that idea that, in heaven, our reputation, whenever the name Catch the Fire Church in Toronto comes up, heaven's like, oh, they pursue God. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. 